at the point per game PPG voting system adopted by the league management company in conjunction with the club owners association to decide placements in the 2019-2020 season has pitched Lobby Stars FC against the league organizing body. The NPFL 2019-2020 was suspended on March 18, 2020 as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. The stakeholders later pushed for a false majority to end the season. To decide the winner, the LMC and club owners adopted the PPG voting system at the weekend, a mechanism which the LMC claimed was a universally accepted standard process to determine games and ensure sporting fairness. At the end of the voting, some clubs, including Lobby Stars, which were sitting close to the top of the league table, before the outbreak of COVID-19 lost their chances of playing in the CAF uh, competitions. Joining us live is uh, Coach Uyuni Dan Kakwi. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, it's a pleasure to be with you guys once again. You're doing a good job. Yeah, Thank, you keep it up. Thank you also. Thank you also. Do you think the LMC took the right decision with the points per game method? Well, I think for me, the Nigerian League has been totally inconsistent. Remember last three seasons, the league was cut off because of uh, political issues between Amanju Pinik and Chris Kiwa. And the league had to be cut off and Lobby Star was uh, given the, the league uh, title then. Then last season again, uh, there was an abridged league. And I think it went on to become a Super Six. And Yimba won it and represented the continent. And this time again, a PPG has been used that's points per game uh criteria and method so i feel will the the lmc needs to really try and get things sorted out and for many nigerians it could have been a very good call for the league to be concluded on yeah on basis of controversy and inconsistency all right but as rightly said i think because of the covid 19 it's the best form of uh, and fair way to to conclude the league. Okay, no, but no a lot of controversy has... has come up and a lot of questions has to be answered. Hopefully, no date has so far been fixed for league resumption. How do you think this might affect the clubs representing Nigeria on the continent? Yes, uh, a very big problem. You no, know, the clubs have to be keeping shape and go for tours. You no, know, and the league. We don't know when the league is starting, even though they proposed first uh, week of, uh, uh, of 2021. But it doesn't look likely because, you know, the COVID-19 is ravaging and clubs don't have money to test their players before and after games. And I think that's one of the major problems. And for me, if a club that is going to the continent, clubs like Platinum United, Yimba yeah. and Kano Pillars, they need to start playing friendly matches and possibly start thinking about going out for foreign All right. uh, tours and foreign competitions to keep their teams in shape. But Thank I think if the Nigerian teams are on a big advantage because you can see other leagues in yeah. Northern Africa have started. Tunisia, Egypt have okay, kicked we're, off. We're, we're, and we're even Zambia time. have kicked um, off. So I think uh, we really need to check us. And LMC really needs to uh, boulder itself to take big steps on starting something up. All right. Thank you so much for sharing with us. Uh, we're totally out of time. Look forward to speaking with you again. Yeah, it's a pleasure.